Another thing that I would love to see some sort of like head to head competition, like they do in boxing, like they do in MMA, where they basically really put two people up against each other. Whatever events, two people against each other. I think that's something that needs to happen. I actually were bit in talks with Donovan Bailey and Michael Johnson about this, about this becoming a thing that they could possibly be a part of because the head to head allows presenters to give more of a story of each person. Absolutely. There's more camera time on each person. There's the actual mono e mono effects that you get from tennis and boxing and stuff like that. And um, it's very adversarial, which is mm. what sells. Mm-hmm. It allows less to have to focus on. From, from a broadcaster standpoint, it's two people. Because right now, yeah, track and field is head-to-head, but it's not really head-to-head. It's kind of head-to-head-to-head-to-head-to-head-to-head-to-head. Mm-hmm. This is one of our arguments that we had, actually, when we got <laughs> into this. I don't know how, exactly how it would be done in terms of how you would pick who would be the head-to-head. So there's eight athletes jumping. This person, this person are head-to-head. And you really hype them. And they're the main, 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 main show. Like in boxing, right? You have these other people leading up to the main fight. This is, I think, one of the biggest things that track and field does not do. I don't understand it. And every top main sport does. Why is there no stat sheet that comes up on the, on the screen? Mm. So for the main two athletes in the event, so whether it's the 100 metres and it's just a normal 100 metres, but let's say it's the two best athletes, that graphic where you see the picture of the person and then on the other side, you see the other picture of the person and then it's like name, age, height, weight, best performance, whatever it is. And with track and field, we'll have our own, you know, and if it's the men's triple jump, longest ever hop, longest ever step, longest ever jump. So then you can actually see Oh, so he's the favorite. Now I see that he's got a better, da, da, da. oh, that's where he's lacking. So then what it does, it educates people that come in. Mm. And that's why these massive sports as well, other than it being like they can get behind a team, they know, they feel like they're part of it. They know what's going on because they can see from the stats what it is that it takes to do what they do. This, I don't understand why they don't have this in the sport. This is right now can be done. This can just be implemented straight away. A company come in, whoever does it for all the other sports, and does those stat sheets for track and field. It can be done right now. 